Hey guys, this is just a quick update. Um, I got something today to help me with my van build, and I thought I would show it to you. It is totally awesome, and I got a, such a good deal on it, and I'm fixing to show you right now. So I'm going to cover up the lens and be like a surprise. So, cover up the lens. Ta-da! I got this tool kit. It's got all these tools in it down there at a little local auction. I've got the angle. I've got I've got one battery. Uh, I already had that though. But I got the, uh, it's an 18 volt set. It's a contractor set I do believe. But I've got the angle drill. It comes with the jigsaw. And I've tested all of them and they work. It comes also with a vacuum cleaner. A skill saw, Oop, a circular saw, I guess would be more accurate. A circular saw, a light, a sander, a reciprocating saw. And a chainsaw. They're all 18 volt. Now I had a Ryobi 2 drill set that came with a couple of batteries and a charger. The lithium batteries. And the lithium, the lithium batteries work in these. Even though uh, the new sets are like that, what, that lime green color. Uh, I had two batteries, but one of them won't take a charge. I don't know why. It's Neither one of these batteries has been used all that much. But somehow or another, the battery is no good. But this battery is good. Now, in my van build, when I'm doing my van things, I'm liable to want to have um, campfires, right? So in order to have campfires, you got to have wood. So that will cut the wood right there. I won't put it all up right now. A reciprocating saw for cutting through whatever I need cut while I'm tearing out everything in the van, whether that be pipes or whatever. I may have to cut through who knows what. A skill saw, or a circular saw, to cut the plywood for the new, for the new walls and, and the ceilings and everything like that. Same with this to do the curves because there's... The, this, the curve of my the, the roof of my van is fairly well curved. Now, the sander can be used on two things. First of all, on the wood to smooth it off to where I can stain it or paint it or what have you. But also to clean up that fiberglass top to so I can re-gel coat it or polish it. As I'm going to have to do some fiberglass work and get rid of two of those holes. Now this is going to be real handy if there's a tight space, okay? I don't know that I'll actually use it. I'll probably end up selling this kit when I get done with my van build, but who knows. The light, of course, so I can see. And this I'll probably keep for sure so I can clean up the van during and after the build. Now, this is like three or $400 set, right? If it had the batteries and the charger. It's got a charger, excuse me. It came with a charger, but no batteries. I got this entire set for $25 at a little auction. Nobody wanted to deal with it because it didn't have the batteries. Well, I have one battery. I'll get a couple of more. And, I, you know, I know what people are saying. They're going to have, they'll be like, well, the batteries won't last that long, you know, because they're just batteries. Well, I don't last that long either. So... If them batteries run out of juice, it'd probably be time for me to take a break anyway. But I'm going to get two more batteries so that I can have at least three batteries. And I'm going to, and I'm going to use this in my van build. Um, so, normally I couldn't have afforded this. What I really wanted was the chainsaw, believe it or not. That was my biggest wish list item, basically. And I have two other 18 volt circular saws but one of them's a craftsman and one of them is a uh, 
port or cable, I think. But neither one of them have batteries or chargers, so I couldn't use them. And so I'm going to get rid of those for $5 a piece down there at the swap meet tomorrow, I hope. But this set right here, along with the drills, the two drills that I already have, I have a regular drill and an impact drill, should do most everything I need done in the van build. So, I mean, it's possible I could probably use a table saw, but I can always use a skill saw and a couple of saw horses, you know. It doesn't have to be, I'm not looking, you know, it doesn't have to be a totally perfect build. It just has to be good enough. But anyway, this is a little update on that. Um, just, I know you guys are expecting a video on the actual van build, but this is the tools for the van build. I just had to get those first. You can't do the build without the tools to put it back together. And since the price was right, I jumped on it while the, while the getting was good. So, anyway, if you guys hit the thumbs up, like, comment, subscribe, whatever, share it with your friends. And y'all come back to see me.